Okay, hello guys. So this is the Mi Max One. The decode name is Hydrogen. And in this video, I'll show you how to press the custom ROM on this one using the new Sandra OS. Okay, it's based on Android 10, but it is ELTS using the latest Android security patch on April 2022. Okay. All the steps and instruction I will provide in my blog. The link is in the description box. Okay, so stay tuned and check it out. Okay, hello guys. Assalamualaikum. We meet again with Omwap. Okay, this time we have another pawn to customize so this is the xiaomi mi max one with the code name is hydrogen hydrogen okay so today we're going to customize this one using the android 10 santara os elts okay elts stand for the extended long term support okay so it has <clears throat> the latest security patch if I'm not mistaken uh, sec security patch in uh, February 2022 okay <clears throat> as usual this is an all phone so it's basically just the same like other pawn okay <clears throat> the first thing you need to do is you want to unlock your pawn okay so let's go to the settings and here we go and see the stock rom the latest stock rom is in the android 7 mu 10.2 and point point two point two okay uh okay and then after that make sure you have remove all emails and don't forget to unlock your phone okay Spawn has been unlocked. You can see right here. Unlocking Xiaomi Pawn is very simple. <clears throat> you can check my other video for the tutorial or other YouTube video. Okay, simple. And after that, once you go to the Facebook, I turn off the phone, and then it goes to the Facebook by pressing the volume down and the power button at the same times. Okay, let's press the two button, and with, when you see the screen, it means that we are in the passport mode. Okay, let's plug the USB cable. And let's switch screen. Okay. You can see right here, this is my file. I will provide all the files and the link, uh, all the files and the instruction in, in my blog. Okay, the link is in the description box. Okay, you can see right here. <coughs> there is two type of Mi Max one, the helium uh, and hydrogen. Okay, the helium it's also called the Mi Max Prime. It has sixty-four gigabytes and one hundred twenty-eight gigabytes Transorets and uh, hydrogen is just 32 gigabyte. Okay, make sure you check the version. Okay, <clears throat> and let's open the hydrogen folder. And here we go as usual, custom recovery. Then open the Windows terminal or CMD and let type some command. <clears throat> Okay, you can go to the Facebook uh, by pressing follow me down and power button and also type this command. Okay, and then it's the custom recovery. Facebook pass recovery and just click on record file. And then we need to boot into the custom recovery. Okay, as usual, just click and drag the file and here we go now we are in the some recovery and 
first thing you want to do is go to the white menu right here go to the hit the format data button and tap yes okay hit enter and let's wait <clears throat> you see in warning right here just ignore it okay just hit the home button again select reboot and recovery okay <clears throat> as i said before make sure that you have the right type okay max one we have hydrogen and we also have helium okay you can always check using the ida64 from the play store or using the passport command okay <clears throat> and it's always a good idea to back up the fs if there is something wrong, you can always restore the EFS. Okay, the EFS contain the baseband and email for the Snapdragon device. Okay, it's quite takes time times for this custom recovery. Okay, just let's wait. Okay, now. <clears throat> swipe it go to the wipe again this time it goes to the fn swipe select delphic data and cast okay swipe again on button <clears throat> as i said before let's back up the fs go to the backup select option tab enable compression for a smaller size go to the backup again uncheck all the options and jelly just select the FS. Yay. Now let's just scan the screen. And make sure you already back up. Sorry, I mean, make sure you copy the backup to a safe place. Okay, let's put it in here. Then let's copy some files. Okay, this is the. <clears throat> uh, some ROM that we're going to use. Okay, the new Centara ELTS Android 10. And we also want to use the gaps. It's ARM64 and Android 10. We're use, uh, going to use the NIC gaps. Okay, let's paste it. Maybe some of you guys want these mages. You can always pass the mages at the end of the process. Okay. This is the latest one. Mages 24.3. Okay, let's switch again. And now hit the home button. Hit the install button. Select the Nusantara OS. Okay, let's swipe it. It's already done. Let's swipe it. Hit the home button. Select reboot and uh, just uncheck all the options and do not install. And here we go. We're back in the custom recovery. Now hit the install button again. This time select the nick caps, add more zip and the mages. Okay. Uh as I always mention, Magis is always optional. Okay, if you don't do not need uh, root access, you can always skip installing the Magis. Okay, it's done. And okay, just for cautions, go back to the home screen, select wipe, select format data, and tap yes. Okay, then hmm. let's reboot the system. Okay. and we go now it's loading the boot screen okay, you can see right here the boot logo changing from the 
Xiaomi boot logo into the new Center OS. And now we are in the home screen. Hey, you can know this. We don't have a welcome wizard because we are using the Nick apps. Okay. I will stop this video and let's continue to make a quick review about this ROM. Okay, stay tuned. Okay, hello guys. So, this is our Mi Max 1 that I'm using the Sandra OS 110. Okay, this is the ELTS, it stands for Extended Line, Extended Long Time Support. Okay, it means that you're using the latest security patch. You can see right here, very nice. Uh, it's for those that are concerned about security. Okay, now let's uh, take a quick review with this drum. It did quite good enough for daily drive run or not okay <clears throat> this thing I want to show you is uh, let's check the uh, storage okay you can see right here the system takes up takes up about 6 GB okay then as usual in the Nusantara you can always customize using the Nusantara wings in here and customize the system, uh, lock screen, uh, and other else. Okay. Now let's test the ROM. Okay. Uh, the basic function of the pawn. Okay. First thing I want to test is the mages. We have successfully installed mages in pawn, in our pawn. And you can see right here. It's running perfectly. Okay. And let's check using the root checker just for fun. And here we go, your Remax is rooted on another 10. Okay. And now let's test GPS. <coughs> okay, let's check the location. Seems it's not running. Okay, I, uh, let's try to turn on, turn off, and turn on again the GPS. Okay, it seems that we need to calibrate the GPS, but it's working. Okay, and very accurate. This is my position. Okay, so there is no problem with the GPS. Okay, now let's <coughs> try to test the camera. We'll test the front and back camera for taking picture and also record video. Okay, and then I will show you. Okay, this is recording using the back camera. And I will stop this video. Okay, now let's switch. Uh, Okay guys, this is recorded using the front camera and I will stop this one. Okay. Now let's take a picture. This is a selfie picture and I will take a picture from the back camera. Okay, seems that all the function is working correctly. Let's check the result. And sorry, I don't have, I don't wear any clothes because it's very hot in here. <laughs> okay, so this is the result of the video from the back camera. Okay, there is no problem with the sound because sometimes usually when it's in custom ROM. We will have a small voice while recording, but 
we don't encounter that one. Okay, let's. <laughs> okay, sorry for my ugly face. This is the sport pass. Okay, this is the selfie one. And this is the back camera. Okay, so all the function of the camera is working perfectly. And let's try another one. What else? Uh, okay, let's try the playback. Okay, let's play some music video from YouTube. Okay, let's play the Raymon song. Here we go. nice <clears throat> the sound is very loud and the video playback is also working correctly okay you can see right here I'm using the Wi-Fi so there is no problem with the Wi-Fi and also the card is working I have tested before the email also safe okay you can see right here so you don't have to you don't have to be worried about using your email okay so we have test the sound video <coughs> for the camera testing the GPS and also sound video playback okay, also the root access and seems that all the basic function is working correctly okay guys that's all this is a tutorial on how to <coughs> customize your Mi Max using the <coughs> latest Lucentro OS Android 10 with the latest security patch okay I hope you like this video if you like please give it a thumb and I also have last video about routing and <coughs> custom ROM maybe you can check my other video maybe some of the video will be useful for you okay and if you subscribe it will make me excited to make me feel okay thank you guys have a nice day stay safe stay healthy and wassalamualaikum